synthesize. Is this okay? Is this okay?
Huh? That's... Nanaka. I wonder if something's wrong. She's crouching down by the road. Nanaka! Is something wrong? Can you stand? Ma! Oh, sorry! I didn't mean to scare you like that. No, no. I'm okay. Is something wrong with the cow? Yeah. We were walking fine until just now. And then she suddenly lost all her energy. Poro, what's wrong? Does your tummy hurt or something? <coughs> Whoa! She's in so much pain. She sounds like a piggy. Aisha, what should I do? Maybe it's an acute sickness. Is it okay if I take a look? Let's see... Huh? The area around her tummy is hard. And it looks like her intestines aren't moving. This is... Is it some kind of bad illness? But, but that sounds serious. No, no. This is... Well, it seems like it's stuck. It? Um, well... Constipation. Oh, I see. My goodness, I told you a million times not to eat any weird grass. Bad girl! <coughs> Good medicine. Medicine? Yep. I don't have it on me since I have to make it differently for animals. But... If the symptom's as light as this, medicinal herbs might do the job. Give me one second. I think I saw it growing around here. Keep you waiting. I'm sure these medicinal herbs will do the trick. They're a little bitter, so I wonder if she'll eat them. Don't worry, she's not picky about her food. She's so greedy, she's a handful. Oh, she ate it! I'm glad! Okay, good girl! I'm happy for you. Now say thank you to Aisha. Whoa! Already? Goodness, that's really embarrassing. <laughs> Maybe her intestines started moving after eating the herbs and... Now she went to go do her business. My... Business. Anyways, thank you, Aisha. You really helped me out. No, no. I'm glad I was able to help. <laughs> Aisha, you were like a veterinarian. You look so cool. A veterinarian? That's a great job. I'm glad she's okay now. But overeating isn't good for you. It seems like you've helped Nanaka. Thank you. Yeah! Mr. Brother! How long have you been here? Yuris, your bad habits. 
puppets are coming out again. You're hiding your presence too much. Uh, I didn't mean to scare you. No, no. I'm sorry I got scared. Sorry, I just unconsciously hide my presence. In any case, this is a nice opportunity to thank you. Because of Nanaka's job, she can't help but estrange herself from people. I'd appreciate it if you could keep being friends with my younger sister from now on as well. <laughs> of course! I'm happy that I made more friends! If you see her again somewhere, please say hello to her. Bye. Whoa! I've never seen my brother talk to someone for that long before! Huh? That was long? He only says the minimum amount that's necessary to people who aren't related to us. I see. Could it be that your brother doesn't like other people? I don't think so. I think he's just a quiet guy. He's often by himself in the forest or up in the mountains, so he doesn't interact with people that often. I guess the same's true for me, too. What kind of job does he have? Since you mentioned forests and mountains, is he like a lumberjack? Simply put, he's a huntsman. He's off running after beasts most of the time. I've heard that animal horns can be used as ingredients for medicine. So, you two might already have some kind of connection, Aisha. Yeah. Maybe your brother's helped me in some way before. I wish I could have given him a more proper greeting. He wanders off as soon as he's done with his business. But if you could be friends with my brother, it'd make me happy too. You're right. I'll greet him properly the next time I see him. <laughs> yes, please. is whispering to me that something's here. Hmm, there's no use just thinking about it. Let's blast it away. Stand back. Three, two, one. a sealed entrance. I smell treasure. Wow, you were right. How did you know? I'm telling you, it's my intuition. When you're a prospector, you can just tell. Anyway, aren't you curious to see what's in there? Let's go look. You're right. There might be some relics from an ancient civilization. Or there might just be the bones of ancient people. <laughs> yeah! Don't scare me like that! It's pretty dark. Should I light something up? No, not yet. There could be some combustible gas in the air. And you wouldn't want to go kaboom when you light the fire, would you? No. I wouldn't want that. We'll know for sure once we go further in. Aisha, follow me closely. Oh, what's this soft thing? Huh? Not too hard, but not too soft. The texture feels like an angel. 
Is this the treasure? Th that's me, Regina! Whoops! Sorry, Aisha! <laughs> Although it's not that different from a treasure. Let's see! Squishy, squishy! Ho ho! Now this is something! Watching you feel so amazing, I can't stop myself! Yeah! Let's just investigate! Huh? Oh, just a little longer! No! Anymore and I'll be confused on a whole lot of issues! Well, I'm reluctant to stop, but I guess I'll get back to work. <laughs> it seems like we're okay to light a fire. Let's get some light in here! I guess there's nothing special here. But the ruin itself does look familiar. Now that you mention it, it looks similar to the ruin in Reason Game. Maybe they're connected. Let's investigate further.
I'll keep calm and do my best. Can't run away. Take these blasts! Executing the command. Take this! All right, I got it! No big deal. Thank <laughs> you. 